Hi, this is Vero from Choose to Be. Today I have another great workout for you. This is for you, Adam. Um, I'm thinking martial art when I'm creating this, this interval. 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off for exercise. Um, I highly recommend you to go through four times. It will be 10 minutes. Um, for the purpose of today, um, I need to catch up very soon. I will just go through two rounds, so I let you keep going through the four rounds. Um, I'm using my interval timer, so uh, hope you're warm up and ready to go. So we're going to be started. By the way, if you're not warmed up, use the first movement to warm yourself up and work through some range of motion. So we're going to go with a squat and a round kick. I'm just going to move this a little bit sideways. Here we go, squat, round kick, squat, round kick. So you want your kick to be from in to out. If you're like feeling a little bit tight, you can just do a deep round kick, just to loosen up. When you do your squat, make sure you watch my tutorial if you're unsure that you're pushing the bum out. So who's the boss? It's your butt, pushing the bum out. Second round, it will do the same thing, but sideways. We're gonna go for a side lunge and a kick. So going to the side, little 10 second rest. Side, you can just play with a knee, gauging through the core, you know, add a kick, knee. So be gentle with the knee as you extend the leg. And you're really engaging through the core, not lean far too much. You want to stay more upright. Side kick. When I was a teenager, I used to do kickboxing. Kickboxing for a few years, actually. Then I used to do fights, and I realized I'm not a fighter. But anyway, I still love the training it gives. So again, you can always do a knee. Making sure you find balance and being gentle with the knee as you extend the leg. Here. Oh, I'm already warming up. Warming up. By the way, I'm in the Chinese garden right now. Beautiful little garden in the limo. Okay, last one. Ninja jump tuck. So your hips are the power in this movement. So here we go. Boom, boom. Coming back down, one knee at a time. Or if you want, you can come down with two knees. So here we go. Boom, boom. So you need to make sure you can do a low squat. And being light on your feet. That was it. One more time through. I'm going to do my squat sideways. Exhale through the mouth. There we go. Squat. Down kick. Bum out. Chest up. Gazing ahead. I always think long spine getting tall. Still pretty early in the morning. <gasps> nice. Okay, I'm gonna start with the other side. If you need extra support, always use your hand. If not, touch the floor. Boom. view or marina view. <sighs> Exhale through the mouth. Really help. Other side. Boom. Boom. I know you're 
looking forward to the ninja <coughs> jump talk. So don't attempt to do the ninja jump talk if you don't have a full range of motion into your low squat. Or just injure yourself. Make sure you can do a low squat. If you're not sure what I'm talking about, I will show it to you right now. So low squat is here. And if you can do it, you can always start with your hands in front of you when you do it like this. And then jump tuck. Or you can also walk it. Yeah. Tuck. And if you walk it on one side, of course, you alternate the leading leg. Full variation. Here we go. Boom. 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 Close it. Nice. That was it. Well, that was two rounds of it. I hope you enjoy it. Let me know some comment and share. Thank you.